it's Matt here from 1610 and uh, today we are testing out a new uh, I guess coffee obviously it is Love Scarlet and that's in Grand Bend and so we got this at the Grand Bend market so if you are in southwestern Ontario you know what check out the Grand Bend market there uh, it's every Sunday I believe uh, runs uh, for sure throughout uh, Sunday um, and throughout uh, the summer uh, but honestly it was a lot of fun um, we had a good time met some really cool people bought some really cool products um, so there's a lot of neat different things so again check it out and that's where we got this stuff um, this coffee is in Grand Bend again um, at I Love or not I Love it is Love Scarlet coffee and so I believe it is a um, cafe in there and so by all means go ahead check it out the guy was incredibly amazing he was super nice uh, friendly stuff like that so I, I don't really have anything bad about them but today we are gonna test out their coffee and, and see what kind of unique profiles they developed with their roast so with that being said um we will get back to you all right so um hang tight all right we'll be with you in a sh second all right all right so welcome back uh so you will see there uh I, I love the pour over, to be quite honest. Pour over is my favorite go-to, especially when tasting coffee. I think it's just, it brings the best out of it uh, versus French press or your automatic dripper, um, AeroPress, stuff like that. Um, AeroPress is more of like a, an espresso-based kind of drink. However, still good. Don't get me wrong. Haven't tried it. Heard a lot of great things about it, though. Uh, we'll eventually try it one day. Um, with that being said, though, so Scarlet, here we go. Let's see how it goes. All right. Um, gotta get that aroma, though. You know what? It it honestly smells a little little nutty and uh, chocolatey at the same time. Oh, all right. Um, that is neat. Wow. That is not what I'm expecting, actually. I did not expect this to actually come out. So, um, honestly, the aroma, kind of nutty kind of chocolatey uh, which is good um but this they kind of had like a more of a, a citrusy flavor which kind of was very unique actually i was not actually expecting that to come out into uh to play there but interesting So, I'm also tasting right now is, it's it's kind of like a smoky kind of flavor. So, when I'm saying smoky, it's it's not like a bad kind of smoke. Like, it is, it is a nice, kind of like your smoky meat kind of thing. Um, that kind of smokiness to it. Um, honestly, like, it uh, might be the best way to describe it is just not your ordinary campfire uh taste like you you but like you you kind of hence that smoking like not smoking but more of what honestly what it really does is it takes you back to you know 
sitting by the campfire. So when you're camping, hanging out with your friends, and you and you just breathe that smoke in, and it's just like, mm, so, so nice, so calming, so relaxing, soothing. That that is when I say smoky. That's what I think of. So remember, don't think of it as like a negative kind of smoking or smoky kind of flavor. Think of it more of like memories, you know? And there's there's that chocolate right there. Got got that chocolate down pat. So overall, I it's good, it's good cop. Uh, what I would probably do, uh, like, to me, I think this is more of a wake me up kind of um, blend. So it's it's like you get up in the morning, freshly grind these, these bad boys, bad boys of beans. Wow, that was a tongue twister and a half. Um, and just enjoy a good cup of coffee in the morning. Take it to work get get a good jump start on your day this is what that this brand kind of reminds me of those kind of coffees all right with that being said uh please make sure you like and subscribe to uh my instagram 1610 co uh facebook as well um and and make sure you just check out our, our website there um there's always going to be deals going on with mugs tea infusers we, we just we honestly don't just sell mug related products we do sell kind of accessories so coasters spoons uh, straws as well um because we all like a cold cup of coffee so like an iced americano those straws are perfect for um with that being said see you next time happy brewing guys take care